everybody, welcome back to War Buddies. It is January 1st of 2021, so kudos to everyone for surviving 2020. I hope that that comment is not going to age poorly in the next year. It's whatever. Anyways, today is, what is it, Friday? Yeah, Friday, 1st of January. I'm picking through Pine Bark right now because we're about to do another Terrain Tips video. For those of you that have been with the channel for a long time, we originally started doing Terrain Tips. That's how the channel got started before my buddy Dave convinced me to choose, start doing battle reports. So that's how we got here. Anyways, what I want to talk to you guys about is just kind of what I have in mind for the next year. Because at the time of this filming, War Buddies is at 904 subscribers, which is like way far and away more than I ever thought this channel was going to get. So thank you guys. Thank you for sticking around. Thanks for showing up, doing the whole battle report thing with me. I do want to give you guys kind of an idea of what we're doing in the future because for this next year, I'd like to focus on the channel, like increasing the production value, growing the channel, growing the audience. It's something I haven't really focused on in a dedicated way in the past. So 2021 is going to be year of the budgie, I hope. But to let you guys know what's going on, we are we're getting back to doing some terrain videos, some of the more random things that I do because I'm cheap. So I like to build things out of hot glue and pine bark. What I'm actually going to be showing you guys how to build are going to be these arc geysers from Warcaster episode one for the prologue. I need to build more of them, so I'll be showing you guys how to do that for like no money at all. Anyways, I'm also going to be relaunching the Warlord Titan project, which I'm sure some of you guys remember. I haven't, haven't worked on it much the past year. Partly because grad school, partly because he broke pretty badly on the move here to Virginia. And uh, just, I have not had the motivation to pick him up again. But I need to. I need to finish that project. He got gold in Armies on Parade when I finished the outside. Now I need to finish the inside, get his arms and things working, get the sound playing and all that. So the Titans are coming back 2021. I'm already getting very ambitious here. As far as battle reports go, I've already talked a little bit in previous videos about Fallout Season 3. That is coming probably towards the end of January. I'll look to get the first episode out. And for those of you that, don't, that didn't catch the previous video, it's going to be a choose-your-own-narrative campaign format. So I'm going to make a post. I'll post a battle report, and then I'll give you guys some options to choose what the characters do next, and then that will lead to another battle report, and so on and so forth. I don't have a set time or a number of episodes, but I'd like to do it for a while. It'll probably be an ever, It's probably going to be an every other week thing, so I have time to write scenarios, test scenarios, and build terrain and all that. But we're doing settlement mode, we're doing choose your own narrative campaign, all that kind of stuff. It's going to be fun. Warcaster is also coming back. We finished up the Jericho Reach prologue last month. So that was a three episode prologue of just introducing you to the factions in the world of Jericho Reach. We're going to be launching the full season of that. I don't know how many episodes yet. Got to map that out. But that will be also here in the new year. Probably late Jan, early February. I want to film a few episodes in advance so I got a buffer, you know, so I, I don't cheap out on you guys. Other than that, I mean, I'm trying to stay pretty open. And I do want to know what you guys want to see on the channel. Just, I mean, in a very open, broad, like, no holds bar type sort of way. I mean, there's things that I would like to do if I had the time. Stop. But the stuff that shows up on War Budgies is really just whatever is in the crossover between what I am interested in and what you guys are interested in. And where that little Venn diagram overlaps, that's where we get battle reports. So if you would, drop in the comments, let me know what you guys want to see in 2021 on the channel. We're looking at terrain videos, maybe some more hobby blog stuff, the Warlord. Battle reports, more battle reports. I like doing battle reports. Try not to do them for a long time. And then I just kind of, yeah, I blame Dave. Dave talked me into it. Thanks, Dave. All right, that's about it. That's about all I got for today. Thank you guys. Thank you very much for hanging out this past year. It has been a weird year. But as far as the channel goes, it's been really successful in the sense of I've been able to turn out more consistent stuff. We did the longer run of battle report campaigns been able to get a lot of work done. We should be, the military has moved us to Virginia now, but we should be staying here for a couple of years at least. So I can build up a bit more of a uh, studio 
<laughs> I'm not gonna turn the camera, I'm in a shed. We have a shed, but it's a nice shed. So gotta get that cleaned up and uh, yeah. Otherwise, happy new year. Thanks for sticking around. Look forward to 2020. Thanks for watching.